Hello there and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to talk about dragon riding and more specifically we're going to take a look at the 16 brand new customizations that are coming to the dragon riding drakes in patch 1007 return to the forbidden reach. Uh, but before we jump into all the customization options guys just want to shout out my twitch twitch.tv slash mr gm. If you want to see me stream world of warcraft, dragonflight, dragonflight 10.1 ptr, uh, rathich king classic and more I'm over on twitch.tv slash mr gm every single day. All right, so yes, patch 10.0.7 is releasing on March 21st in the NA region and March 22nd in the EU. And with this patch, there are a ton of features. And one of the features we're gonna talk about today is new dragon riding customizations and 16 of them to be exact. Now, some of them don't have sources right now, which is kind of odd. Maybe it's a secret, maybe they're just not implemented. I'm not really sure. And some of them are not like brand new appearances, but they're appearances that weren't actually implemented uh, previously. So like some of the missing kind of manuscripts uh, that weren't available in 10.0 and 10.05 are now available in 10.07. So there are new things for each of the drakes, so let's jump into it. So first and foremost, we are going to talk about the Renewed Proto Drake. Now the Renewed Proto Drake actually got the most amount of customizations, including some new ones, but this is the only one that got brand new appearances that weren't previously, you know, data mined or whatever. So firstly, we're going to take a look at some of the new horn options. So you have this one here, Malevolent. Yes, Malevolent is coming, and this is a reward from the Forborg rep, which is one of the new reputations of patch 1007. You can now get uh, exalted with them, and there are some rewards from that. So these horns here are from being revered. Uh, it's a really crazy look compared to some of the others. So just like a ton of horns on your head there. Uh, big fan of that. Uh, so yeah, that's the uh, the new malevolent horns there. Uh, the next one is Bruiser. So as you can see there, it says source, question mark, question mark, question mark. So we have no idea on this one. Could be a world drop, could be anything, uh, or again, could be not implemented. This is the release client of 1007. So it must be out there somewhere. Uh, it's just a bit of a mystery on where that is specifically. So this is the Bruiser horns for the renewed Proto Drake. And finally on the horns, you have the antlers. Yes, the antler option, I believe was on the other drakes as well, but it is finally coming uh, to the renewed proto drake here. Uh, the source of this is the scarer vaults, which is one of the new features of the Forbidden Reach. Uh, so hopefully it'll be behind one of those doors. You'll be able to get the antler appearance for your renewed proto drake. Next up, we're gonna take a look at a new tail option called pronged. Uh, the source for this again is question mark, question mark. So you can kind of see it at the back there. It's a little hard to see, uh, but yeah, you can see it's just a bunch of horns really. Uh, similar to the spine tail, but like thicker kind of spikes coming out of the back there. But yeah, you can see that that is the pronged tail and that'll be available in 1007. But yeah, we're not sure on the uh, kind of source of that right now. Also in 10.07, we're getting a brand new snout. Yes, we're getting the stubby snout. This is a, I believe it's been in the game before, but again, not available. This is available from being honored with the Fulborg rep of the Azure Span. Uh, really cool looking, actually super unique to some of the other ones. So it does definitely change the look and feel of your Drake. Uh, so stubby will be available in 10.07. Uh, for you from the Fulborg rep at Honored. Moving on, we have a new jaw, which is now plated. Uh, so plated there, you can see it on the bottom there, just below the stubby snout. Uh, again, the source on this is question mark, question mark, so not really sure on this one specifically, uh, but this is coming in, yeah, in the patch at some point, it seems. And finally, we're gonna take a look at a new brow option, the plated brow option. Uh, not massively unique, so you can see like it's kind of similar to some of the other ones, uh, but yeah, this is kind of like, just adds a little bit more kind of, you know, plating to the eyebrows there instead of some of the other options that were available. So you're going to get a plated brow for your renewed Proto Drake. And that is actually available from the Reach Racers purse, uh, which I believe is a reward from obviously the uh, Dragon Riding Racers. Next up, we're going to take a look at the worst Dragon Riding mount, and that is the Windborn Velocidrake. Uh, three options here for the Velocidrake. So on the back here, you have a new option for Exposed Fin. So you can see that it's very similar to the fin, but yeah, a little bit more kind of thick in regards to like kind of the spikes coming out of it there. Uh, so that is a new option, which is going to be available. That is from uh, being honored with the Forborg rep of the Zer Span. Also for the Velocidrake are two new throat options. So you have a exposed finned neck, which is similar to the back, as you can see at the bottom there. Uh, that is available from the Forbidden Reach, just one of the vendors there. And the spiked neck as well, which is also available from the Forborg rep at Revered. So yeah, you can see that down the bottom there, you're going to get a spiky neck or you can get a thinned neck and those are the two options for the throat which are coming in 1007. 
Next up, we're going to take a look at the best dragon riding drake, and that is the Highland Drake, and a couple of options which are available for that. So the first one is Sleek Horns. This is coming, and this is available from the Forborg rep at Honored. Uh, it's kind of a slick back, larger horn style, which is kind of nice. Big fan of that, and as obviously you can change the colors and things like that of it as well. Also, there's a new chin option, so we're going to take a look at that, and that is the Horned Chin. Uh, you can see that there. So just kind of some extra spikes there. Uh, so there's the spikes option and there's the horn chin. So it's just kind of like four kind of spikes coming out of the bottom of the chin there. That'll be available from the Forborg rep at Revered. Uh, and finally, a new nose option, which is the tapered nose. Uh, so you can see there, it's kind of a horn, but not a horn. Uh, just kind of like makes it, uh, kind of changes the silhouette quite a bit of your drake as well, which is kind of nice. And that is obviously available with all the different snouts as well. The tapered nose is just available on a vendor on the Forbidden Reach for 2,500 elemental overflow. And finally, we're going to take a look at the cliffside wilder drake. So, uh, we have a couple options here. So we have a new horn style. Uh, this is called spiked horns, which I am a big fan of. Uh, kind of a tall horn style with a bunch of different horns sticking out of it as well. I actually, as mentioned, I really, really like that. I think it's super unique and super awesome. I'm just, yeah, just a big fan of the uh, new horn style for this. I'm not the biggest fan of this Drake in general, but I think this horns look really good and unique. Uh, this is available from the Forwalk rep at Revered as well, so there's a lot of options there available uh, with that new reputation in 10.07. Uh, and finally, there is a new nose option as well from the Forwalk rep at Honored, and that is the plated nose, as you can see there, the uh, very similar to the Highland Drake, kind of adding this kind of weird point to the snout there. Um, yeah, but the yeah, interesting. That that option is pretty unique, pretty different, kind of adds to the silhouette of the Drake. And uh, yeah, so that'll be available from the Forborg rep at Honored. So there you go, guys. That is all of the brand new options coming to your Dragon Riding Drakes in Patch 10.07. Uh, let me know down below what you think of these options. Uh, obviously, with Patch 10.1 now announced, we're going to get a bunch of new options, hopefully then as well. And we'll be covering that on the channel. But yeah. Guys, thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, please leave a like on it and subscribe if you haven't already. If you want to support me outside of YouTube, I also have a patron and I'm over on Twitter at MrGMYT. Uh, I also have a Discord channel as well. And as mentioned, I am streaming on twitch.tv slash MrGM. If you want to see me streaming Dragonflight, Dragonflight PTR, 10.1 is coming up. Super excited for that. Uh, but if you want to check me out, guys, twitch.tv slash MrGM every single day. And with that, guys, I'll see you next time.